three image backgrounds on your custom build on the AO Knox skin on Cody. Make sure a big thanks to Big Noid for creating the AO Knox skin and visit Cody.tv for more information. What's up guys, it's XBM Connect here and this is part three of the AO Knox customization for your Cody setup. So now that you have installed, uh, you've already customized your menus and your uh, sub menus this is how mines look like so you got movies and all the um, sections of the add-ons that I chosen to to uh, have the information on which would be all my sub menus and then you can see right here and then more right here so what we're gonna do is change the whole background to um, right here now before you do that I highly uh, recommend you actually putting all your uh, pictures inside the XBMC, uh, I mean, uh, Cody folder. So we're gonna go ahead and um, exit this out real quick. Let me force quit that real quick, okay. So I have my backgrounds, uh, as you can see right here, and they're all pretty looking, and I have a, a splash, and I'll show you that in a sec, and I have all these other ones as well. If I click on it, let's see. So I can show you. So that'll be for movies, and then this will be for TV shows, or whatever you want. And then this is the splash that uh, shows up instead of Cody. I've made my very own. So you're gonna. Um, I'll show you how to install that and make. Uh, not make it, but install it. So uh, I'm on a Mac, so it may be different from you on your Windows. Uh, you're just gonna go ahead to your uh, Cody folder, which will be this one right here so as you can see I have um, let's let's make this bigger sorry about that so you got uh, I got right here Cody and then uh, I got my add-ons media sounds system user and etc so we we're gonna go ahead and put it in the the add-ons folder. Now at the bottom right here, you can see actually Aeon uh, skin Aeon Knox Five, and there's a backgrounds folder that has all this. So you can see that's the the picture that you've seen earlier. Um, what we're gonna do is actually um, add a folder in here, or actually I'm gonna put a backgrounds. And I'm gonna add a folder in here if you want, only if you want, or you could actually um, make uh, what do you call this? Get all these pictures and install it in here. Sorry about that. And then drag it all in here if you want. And I'll show you uh, in a little bit why. Um, but I made it to where like it, like this. So I'm gonna delete this real quick. And again, I'm gonna. Uh, have this right here and these two um, in here as well now if you have a splash splash is the ones that um, in the beginning where it says code Cody and all that um, you're gonna put that in the media folder on the, the Cody folder as you can see it says Cody you're gonna put in media and then um, the size is I think uh, 1280 by 720p I think or whatever you want and you're just gonna drag it and you gotta make sure that the name is uh, splash.png or else it won't read it so you're gonna put it in the media folder and then we're good to go so we're gonna go open X, uh, Cody right now let's do that again sorry about that uh, quit that real quick it was minimized, sorry about that. Put all that in the folder. Uh, we're gonna open up Cody. And that's the first thing you, you saw real quick. It was, it was the splash that I created. So, now that you have all the folders in there, uh, when you back it up, it's gonna go with the backup instead of uh, having it on your desktop, on your computer, or wherever you placed it. It's a safer place to put it in there. So we're gonna go to uh, system and go to skin settings, and then gonna go to, um, there's two ways you can do this. You can do it from the general, 
the setup background images and um, you could do it uh, whichever you want right here which you've made but the only thing right here it doesn't show you that custom uh, menu that created with the kids or whatever uh, custom menu that you had uh, created with the customs right here so what we're gonna do is uh, for the movies we're gonna go to set item background now if you have a single picture which we do I'm gonna show you that right now so you're gonna go single image background and then you're just gonna navigate to where um, your Cody uh, folder is and I ha I'll have all this description uh, down below where uh, your actual folder is so now that you come to here you're gonna see add-ons and then we're gonna scroll down or just scroll up and it'll take you to skin Aonox 5 now when you click on that you'll be in the Aonox folder now remember we did put in the backgrounds folder and you can see all the um, fan art that it has that came with the, the actual default of Aonox so you see this one right here we're gonna go ahead and click on that and we're gonna click on out of it when you click on movies and there you go it actually changes now we're gonna do that again we're gonna go to uh, settings system settings and then Aeon Knox and go TV shows this time set item background and set angle uh, in, set image and then just navigate to your um, your Cody folder so as you can see right here and then Cody and then go to add-ons scroll up say on uh, Knox and then go to backgrounds and we're gonna go ahead and do the couple watching TV and now when you go to movies and then it shows when you go to TV shows it actually shows that and then it goes back to that now uh, you could have it all uh, linked up to one by one and it changes and all that but if you want it to actually just a global uh, background I haven't found a way to make it easier but you have to do it on all of them which kind of sucks so you're gonna go to uh, home window you know Knox and then you're gonna just um, let's go ahead and take off the TV shows and this time we're gonna go set multi image background when you choose that you're gonna go ahead and go to your um, again I, I, I told you it's it's a lot tedious and you gotta have uh, kind of patience so add-ons skin and knocks backgrounds and we're gonna go to the actual background XBMC backgrounds that you have made so the reason why you won't be able to see the, the other pictures because you've chosen multi backgrounds so we're gonna go to XBMC backgrounds and then click OK and then we're gonna go ahead and change that so so far we've done this like this it's been normal and then movies is still like that then TV shows and now I'm gonna wait till it actually changes so you can see the transition on um, how it changes so you see it right there so you could have like tons and tons of um, images for for each one so if the if this was TV shows it'll show a bunch of TV shows or you could actually use the fan art that they actually uh, have chosen which I actually uh, don't have any metadata right now for you to show but that is one way so if you go to TV shows um, and go to set item background again and you could use it right here but you have to have um, a plethora of metadata that you've already uh, have installed or with it so that's how pretty much uh, to do the the backgrounds of changing it so you backgrounds right there now if you want it for everything then you'd have to do it the same thing and always don't forget to add XBM connect to all your social media